Hello, my name is William Lawson from GetWise Marketing. I hope you're well. And I'm here to answer another dental SEO question that I get asked quite a lot. And that is, what does it take to beat my competitors? Well, it depends on several things. First of which, it depends on the competition. And when I mean competition, I don't mean just the people you're competing against, but I mean the, the, the competitiveness of the keyword you're trying to rank for. Um, if you're trying to rank for uh, um, a keyword like Invisalign London, it's going to be extremely competitive and you can expect to pay an SEO company uh, quite a large amount of money uh, for them to get you on the first page. So if you're in competitive niches, it's going to be a lot harder. Second of which is it depends how aggressive your campaign is. Now, this is in relation to the first point, because if you're in a niche that's got high competition, then you need to be very aggressive with your strategy. Otherwise, you won't get anywhere. On the other hand, if the keyword and the niche that you're trying to optimize for has got a low competition, then your SEO doesn't need to be as aggressive to get where you want to get. Third thing here is it depends where your current ranking is. I mean, if your website is not even listed in the top 150 by the time you start a campaign, then there's a good chance you're not going to fly to page one as soon as you start optimizing for your keywords. Uh, whereas if you started off on page three for the keyword you want, then you've got less distance to travel to get to the first page. The next thing here to look at is um, how regularly are you going to commit to ad content? Uh, now, if you're using a good SEO company, they would be taking care of this for you. But these days, regular content is absolutely critical if you want to beat your competitors. And if you're not creating good um, quality, regular content, your competitors will be, and they'll always beat you. So that's just a quick overview. Uh, there's lots more to this than what I've just explained, but I've just gone over the basics here. Uh, I don't really want to drown you in any unnecessary information, but I hope this has been helpful to you. Thank you.